Anyone who drives through Kaka'ako these days knows it can be a maze of coned off streets, metal plates, and mysterious dips that aren't your average pothole. Gina Mangieri is always investigating and looked more into what's going on. So, Gina, what have you learned? Well, it largely has to do with this network of drainage and utility uh, pathways underneath streets. And they're called culverts. Well, they're starting to deteriorate and collapse right under the roadway. It can be very dangerous. Sinkholes, thankfully small, popped up near Alamoana Park a couple of times. Other pukas beneath the boulevard and under Pensacola were caught and addressed, but a lot of times those are only temporary fixes, and all of these areas will require extensive permanent repairs. So what's causing this? We went to experts to ask, who point to a variety of things. Age and decay, also even heavier traffic, and maybe even development in the area that may be affecting the, what's, where the water is following its pathway out. Also, the gradual effects of sea level and groundwater rise creeping up right underneath. So we're digging into more, you know, what's the risk here? Should we be worried about the stability of buildings in the area? And they clarify that, that the, especially the new buildings, built real safe. But what about the roads, the sidewalks, and the older buildings? And you're also digging into the solution, what can be done. Right, and how much it might, might cost taxpayers. Ooh, okay, and that's in your full report tonight on the News at 10. Yes. All right, thank you so much, Gina, for being here. Thank you.